is time for the Halloween event in Star Stable, so let's check out what is brand new this year. There's Poe the Crow trying to get my attention. What's going on, Poe? I bring you word of where to go. Speak to Poe the Crow, travel through the portal, and meet Casper in Galloper's Keep. Others hide and don't make a peep, but you must brace for Galloper's Keep. Have no fear, little mortal. Be brave. Go through a portal. I've told you all that I know, so without delay, off you go, says Poe the Crow. Look at the map. Look at all of the pumpkin portals. Oh, I can see one. I can see the tornado. Okay, before we go into the portal. Let's go to the tornado. Oh, it's getting dark and creepy. The tornadoes are really important. That's how you get your soul shards. And they appear every hour on the hour. There's the ghost. Collect my soul fragments to make my soul whole again. Collect the fragments. There's one chasing me. It's trying to catch up with me. Which you can't do the log in, log out glitch like you could do last year. But you can find the ghost where it was standing. Try to memorize where it was standing. And then you can click on it again. And it looks like you can recollect soul shards. That way you're not grinding all day long. Because this can be a very grindy event. So there we go. I collected all the soul shards. I'm going to kind of run off. Now I'm going to run back. And you only get three soul shards per ghost. So you don't get very many. Into the portal we go. Wait, did I go into the portal? Or did I jump through it? Entering Galloper's Keep. Here we are. Where's Galloper? All right, let's pan in and let's see. What does it say? Galloper's Keep. There he is. He's watching over the whole Halloween party. Oh, I hear pumpkins. They're always here to greet you, singing and dancing. All right, so this is what we're collecting. We're now collecting the autumn tokens. Hey, you're in Galloper's Keep. This place has been around for a long time. Too long. So long. Eternity. There's a ghost cat over here. Galloper's looking for souls, of course. He'll haunt unsuspecting people around, dragging their souls back to the keep. Did he get your soul? He got mine. It's not that bad. We get new people and new friends all the time over here. Every year, something is unexpected and exciting, and it gets dragged in here. I'll tell you right now, this place is more like Galloper's playground. You just gotta know where to look and ignore all the death and the darkness and stuff. All right, we are going in to Galloper's Keep. So there are some new things definitely for this year. First of all, let's go and say hello. Hello, happy Halloween to Galloper himself. Hi, Galloper. Happy Halloween. Okay, I guess that means happy Halloween back. There's everybody down there. Let me jump into the cauldron. Oh, that didn't, that didn't work. Please be advised, approach the cauldron at your own risk. We take no responsibility for anything or creature falling in. Your death is your own responsibility. I'm going for it. I'm going for a big jump. Ready and go. Woo! Oh, there's like a stopper right there. Oh, what happened? What, what happened? I don't know. Something happened. Don't, don't jump in the cauldron. I warned you. They brought back some of the shops. So we've got the mask shop that has all the different masks, which I really like using these all year round. Me too. Let's see what we have in this shop. There's the vintage treasure store where you can buy Halloween items from the previous years. Buy something cool We've got the afterworldly attire it has previous Halloween items in here. These are really good sets. I love the Halloween sets. The clothing sets are so beautiful. Hey, look, here's the item I'm wearing now. This is the tack my horse is wearing. We've got a shop back here, which I already purchased everything in here, but there is a little shop. And then what is this one? Okay, the doomed discount shop. If you want something from this store, this is the one to pay attention to for sure because Star Stable said that these items are gonna be retiring forever. At Galloper's Keep, you can purchase new and old Halloween items to suit your costume needs. If the spooky costumes from older Halloweens are what you desire, you can find them at the doomed discount shop. These particular items and sets are here for a final time and discounted 50% off. So if you want one of these items, do not miss it. It is now your time to grab it, especially since they're 50% off now. What? They're retiring this cute little spooky pumpkin brooch? It's so cute. All right, we've got this little dancing ghost right here where you can exchange your soul shards for autumn tokens. So just like that they did at Camp Western, you can only do these three exchanges every single day. That's why it's important to collect your soul shards because you're gonna need those autumn tokens. What are you gonna need them for? Well, let's look at the token goods. Oh, yes. Okay, this is what you were saving up all of your autumn tokens for. They've got the Wednesday Adam, I mean, Goth Academia set, which looks like this right here. Next up, we've got the Highland Rebel Cowboy. That's gonna be this set right here. Oh, I love that. I love that. That corseted shirt top, very cute. Then the rest of the items are from previous Halloween sets. Okay, but we've got an outfit right here. We need to find out more information about this one. Oh, maybe that's a reward for the cauldron. I can't talk to Karen the ghost. 
the tormented one. What happened? I heard a sound like I activated a quest. This is pretty exciting too, because all of the Halloween horses from the previous years are here, <gasps> including the Windfell. You guys, this one is supposed to be retired. If you wanted this one, it was supposed to retire last year. You better grab it now while you can. It's 300 star coins. Don't tell Star Sable. So here are all the Halloween horses. The new Halloween horses are not here yet. There's two of them that have not been added to the game yet. So save your star coins if you would like to buy the new ones or pick up one of these ones. You will not be disappointed. These are such great horses. The Halloween horses are super, super nice, high quality. I love them and really different than the rest of the horses in your stable. There's cute little critters over here. This is where the new horses are gonna be stabled. Hi, they're, they're coming, coming soon. soon. All right, let's race around over here. This is Tower Isle. That was so fun whenever Galloper was trapped in here. That was so fun. This is the Island of the Hopeful. Pretty, isn't it? This is very pretty. So they've got little candles. You can sit out, have a little picnic. It's great to just hang out with your friend or club members. <gasps> I'm sure this kitty would love to hear ghost stories. Hi. Woo! Oh, I jumped into the cauldron. Now that we've explored around Galloper's Keep, now we've got the typical Halloween things that we normally do every single year that you wanna definitely make sure you do daily. So there's the new Scarecrow Hill race. I like that they're actually updating the races. It would be fun if they did it each year and then like rotated all the different races. Oh wow, okay, so now they're sending crows to get you. Are those crows? Yeah, they're crows like electrified crows, instead of like throwing those little sleep bombs at you. Oh no, careful, don't get electrocuted. Oh, like that, there's a witch. Oh, crow ran into me. Oh, this is different, so we're going a different way now. Oh, don't miss the checkpoint. So now we're actually riding around Golden Hills Valley and back through the portal. So do not forget to get it, because now each time you do it daily, you're gonna get two autumn tokens and 300 horse XP. So whatever horse you're training, this is perfect for it. All right, the Headless Horseman race is back. This one is also one of my favorites because you get to step back in time, actually ride as Galloper. It's a really eerie race. I heard there was one update. Oh, there's a soul shard in here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Grab that soul shard. How do I grab that? I need that. It won't let me grab it. I got it. Okay, so the soul shards are just randomly scattered. Hopefully I didn't miss one in the Scarecrow race. So I heard there was one thing that was changed in this. So let's see if it is indeed true. Remember for the longest time they had a giant squirrel that would follow you around looking at you? I mean, it was massive. It was a massive squirrel. And then they took it away. I thought I saw in one of the Halloween trailers that it's back, that they put the squirrel face back. All right, here we Oh, they did! They did! They put it back! Oh, I'm so happy! It's so creepy. Look how creepy it is. Did you hear it? It was trying to communicate with me. Hi. Yes, you are creepy. Oh, I can't even get back to you. Hi. <laughs> That is so creepy. I don't know why they took it away. Maybe they thought it was too scary, but Star Stable players can definitely handle scary. Oh, now I can talk to Karen the ghost. Let's see what she has to say. No, I don't understand why you're being so difficult. Can you just look? Now you made me raise my voice. Remember what my mom always said, Karen, deep breaths in. Ow. Grumble bubble. Here comes another rider who wants to brew a potion. Oh, I've never seen this cauldron so moody before. Good thing I'm not a moody person. Where are my manners? Oh, mama would be ashamed of me. Oh, and you, you're Honey, the YouTuber. I heard so much about you, I'm subscribed. Yes, we even watch YouTube here in Galloper's Keep. No one ever said how cute you were. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, that was very inappropriate. Keep it professional. The cauldron is misbehaving. You need to help me feed it to calm it down. It wants moss, ghost goo, and a spider egg. Find these things, come talk to me again. Okay, you can easily find these. You should be able to easily find them, I guess I should say, around the keep. Let's see if it was as easy as the previous Halloween. I already found one of them, the ghost goo. It was just random, I just kind of randomly clicked. Oh, like that, see, they're kind of sparkling. So here's a spider's egg. Oh, it says I already have moss. Oh, I got moss right here. That's just regular moss whenever you like collect it, like for the Pharaoh quest. Wow, you found it so fast. Let's see if the cauldron accepts her offering. Put moss, ghost goo, and spider egg into the cauldron. Okay, throw it in. Let's see what happens. All right, it's bubbling. Now it wants ghost goo, a worm, and rubia into the cauldron. All right, back to searching for it. Oh, I see something. I saw something glowing and twinkling. Okay, I think that was the rubia. There's the worms. They're in the little dirt clumps. You can see them wiggling around. That should be everything. Oh, but here's an extra spider's egg that we can collect. Take that. Just good to always have it on hand because you never know what the cauldron's gonna want. Back to the cauldron. Put items in the cauldron. Okay, she gave me some autumn tokens. Don't forget to stop by the Dungeons and Pumpkins and play the mini game there. Each day you will get autumn tokens, XP, and Jorvik shillings. There's no change to this game. This is exactly the same as it's been in the prior years. There's the ghost. Happy Halloween.
take the pumpkin. And now it's chasing me. Oh, there's Game Masters on. Hi, Game Masters. They look so good. It's Game Master Wilma and Game Master Ingrid. Wait, what? <laughs> what was happening? <laughs> Say our players are bugged. Oh, look at what is happening here. <laughs> Look at the face. Look at that face. It's so lovely to meet you. Look at, there's like skeleton bones right here. Look it. <laughs> She's missing her arms, but you can see a tiny little hand right here. No arm on this side. People in Star Stable are getting body parts bugged up because we're eyeing some bugs as we speak. I think the bugs are perfect for Halloween. It's so spooky. I mean, it is. Look at the face. Look at this person. Oh, look at that. Love it. Look at that player. Look at that glitch. Look at this one. It definitely adds some spookiness here at Galloper's Keep. While we're in Jarlheim, I heard they added in some new Halloween makeup. So let's go into Heavy Metal Scissors. Oh, I don't see any new makeup. Maybe it hasn't been added to the game yet, but there is supposed to be new makeup coming. Now it's time to check out the Enchanted Pumpkins. It's once again our season with a brilliant orange moon hangs in the sky. Some of us pumpkins become possessed or enchanted by Pandoric energy and excitement spreading throughout your vision. Yes, it's time for the pumpkin hunt in Golden Hills Valley. I can see the confusion on your face, little one. What is it that motivates us to come alive just to hide? It's the emotions installed in us by you humans. People of olden times called the full moon around this time the harvest moon, followed by the hunting moon. You've put so much time tending to our very needs to ensure that the harvest will be bountiful this year. Oh, such joy and trepidation. What is the point of the hunt if not for the challenge? And isn't the reward much greater when you have overcome the obstacles set before you? Perhaps this mischievous streak in us comes from the season. Do not fret, little one. You will be rewarded for completing the hunt. Maybe one of us will join you as an adventuring companion. It'll be the luck of the draw to decide when and if that will happen. Are you up for the challenge of finding us? Step through the portal next to me to learn the rules of our little game. Oh, Yidris. Is he gonna sprinkle a little bit of magic on the pumpkin patch? Probably. So everything appears normal in the pumpkin patch at Jasper's. They're getting water. They're getting sun. Oh, but Jasper's not having it. He knows something is going on. And just like that, the little gourd shakes alive, opens its little eyes, and the pumpkin season has begun. Oh, Jasper, be careful. <laughs> there we go. Oh, he's out of here. My pumpkins are possessed. Yep, just like every year. There they go. Try to kind of watch where they go and then just collect them. Come join us. Oh, what did it reward me with? I didn't get a golden pumpkin like last time. Okay, so I went back through the portal. Now let's talk with the big pumpkin again. So now that I've activated the quest, now I'm go back through the portal. Now I'm on the search for the pumpkins, which I do have a video up from the previous year of how to find the pumpkins. Oh, but that's convenient. It's right here. But just in case you needed that, I will have it linked below. All right, have those little babies run. Now let's go find them. Oh, I saw one right up here. Got you. Bring them all back. Oh, she's gonna attack me. She's biting me. All right, we just have to wear her out. Oh, she doesn't make sound like she normally does. Normally she makes like a pumpkin sound. She's just so silent. So that's definitely different from last year. All right, now she's asleep in the bush. Let's see, what does she reward? Okay, let's go back to the pumpkin in the keep and see if that's where you go and collect your reward. So they changed things up this time. Whoop. Go through. Well done. If you wish for another challenge on this day, go through the portal and speak to the small spirited pumpkin on the info sign. So that actually gave you some XP, your shillings, some autumn tokens, and look at what else it gives you. Oh, a sorceress squash. This gorgeous gourd is the fastest of the patch. Its legs may be small, but its head is strong. I love it. It looks like it's like glow in the dark. And yes, this is a run along the side of you pet like this. See how it follows me? Oh, that is so cute. What a cute pet. So make sure you definitely get your free pet. All right, let's go through again. Like the pumpkin said, go up to the sign. There we go. Okay, so now we've got another explanation point here. More mischievous sprouts and pumpkins in Golden Hills are eagerly waiting for you to find them. So now you can get 50 Yorvik shillings. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so they changed it up just a little bit, but I love that. I love that you don't have to grind this as much since we're already grinding for the soul shards. Oh, it's so cute. It looks like a little ghost. It's so spooky and glow in the dark. Oh, there they are. I see him dancing. All right, have them run off again. I found you. All right, go back to your mom. Careful. Yep, she's still mean. Yeah, she should definitely be making a sound. I think that that probably is not correct that she's silent. Now, instead of her giving you a reward, we gotta go back to that little gourd on the fence now if we want the reward. All right, and collect 50 Yorvik shillings. So you can get that each and every time now. Do not forget to go on the haunted trail ride too. They brought that back. Always great to have that back. Let's try the cauldron again. So I heard that if you use a soul shard, rubia, and ash, and all the credit goes to Sweet Berry Paws on Instagram, that this is the recipe that they used. So let's just try it out and see if that happens. 
Rubia and Ash. All right, let's just see. Because that is the cauldron pet that you can get this year. It's a cute little cat. But it is random. Okay, I didn't get the cat, but look at what I did get. I got the haunted dressage jacket and the haunted dressage saddlebag. So that's the recipe to actually get items. So I need to find more Ash. Okay, I had some in my storage from last year. So let's try it again. Soul Shard, Rubia, Ash. What is that? That's, I don't know what that one is. Okay, but I've got a skeleton powder and a blazing powder. So now that I have enough soul shards, do not forget to do this too. Do not forget to redeem your soul shards for autumn tokens. You can do this daily, but that's it. Just once daily for each one of these. So give 15 soul shards for three autumn tokens. Give 10 for two. Give five for one. Definitely make sure you do this at least daily. All right, I finally got the free cauldron cat. Finally, finally, finally. So I use that exact same recipe, the shard, the rubia, and the ash. So you can see I put those three items into the cauldron and then surprise, surprise, there's the cat. So it was maybe like my fifth or sixth time trying the cauldron. So let's take a closer look here. It's so cute. It's called the Necro Meow. Sir Kitty. This could be the legendary witch kitty who fell into her cauldron during the full moon and got transformed. Or is it just a regular cat in a witch hat? <laughs> so cute little story on the cat. And of course, this is a run next to you pet. So this is the surprise pet that is in the cauldron. You can absolutely get it. Just make sure to use that recipe. And of course, if you want the haunted dressage set too, I'm still trying to collect the rest of those pieces. Use that same recipe as you guys saw in the video to get the pieces for it. Get the cat, get your free little... Sorceress Squash. Thank you to Star Stable for giving us two free pets and a free outfit in the cauldron. So let me know below if you were able to get it, which you're gonna be able to get it, right? Of course, of course you're gonna be able to get this cute little cat. I believe in you, you can do it. We can all have this cat for free and the little squash pet. Happy Halloween to everybody and I will see you guys in my next video, right? Yeah, she's saying right. She looks really happy. Bye you guys.